PurePass Studio for Portable Audio allows you to create custom algorithms for a new family of mini DSP audio codecs, including the TLV320 AIC3254. This easy to use software tool can drastically reduce software development time for months to even days. PurePass Studio for Portable Audio includes various ready to use algorithms for dynamics processing, including DRC and AGC, extensive filtering capabilities, and much more. This video series will help you get started using this powerful software tool. In this video, we are going to learn how to perform simple operations and read the result using the memory tool. The mini DSP devices have coefficient memory and data memory. Coefficient memory can be directly accessed through registers and its data can be transferred into the data memory as an operand of a particular operator. Let's start with a very simple example, adding two numbers. We first place an add data component on the diagram window, as well as two coefficient to data components and one data to coefficient component. And we connect them together. The data to coefficient component allows us to read the result from the operation. Let's try adding 0.25 plus 0. So we click this component and assign 0.25 as the coefficient. And we select build on the menu bar and download the code. Once the diagram window shows as a solid color, select Tools, I2C Memory Tool, but before we click on the Peak button, which reads the data, we need to find which processor and coefficient RAM address it belongs to. So if we go back to the diagram window and we click the D to C component, we observe that the target processor is Mini DSP D and the component interface is coefficient 2. We now go back to the memory tool and select mini DSP D address 2. Since we are working with double buffer coefficients or adaptive mode, we switch buffers and then we click the peak button and we see our results and as expected we have 0 0.25. It is important to take into consideration that by default the coefficient memory is in 1.15 data format, while the data memory has 12 dB of headroom or a range of minus 4 to 4 minus 1 LSB. If we try to add 0.75 plus 0.75, this will result in 1.5 in data memory, but will saturate when converted to coefficient memory. Let's see what happens. Let's try this. address 2, 1. To prevent saturation, we can shift to the right by one bit using the shift option of the D to C component. We click the D to C component, shift 1 to the right, we download the code, and the result will be 1.5 divided by 2. Thanks for watching this video. Please visit the TI community for more PurePath related videos and discussion. Thank you.